Let's eat, let's eat, let's eat, a. Let's eat, let's eat, let's eat, a. Let's eat, let's eat, let's eat, a. Let's eat and critique. Let's eat, let's eat, let's eat, a. Let's eat, let's eat, let's eat, a. Let's eat, let's eat, let's eat, a. Let's eat and critique. Yummo bucko. Okay, so I was driving today because I'm on my way to get my hair cut. And I noticed this food truck right here called 24 7 Eats. Now they are located in Portlock Road. Y'all probably know they used to have a tiny giant over there. And then they got the Deli Knees. You go right on up, you see Cathedral of Faith and the railroad tracks. This food truck is here every day and they close at 3 a.m. So when y'all leave out of church service or if you leave out of the club, you can come to this food truck and they're the only food truck I believe that's on DoorDash. And on Juneteenth, they're gonna have a Father's Day cookout right over there. So all the village of men who help raise children come on out. They are at 2205 Portlock Road, Chesapeake, Virginia. Let me just tell you, number one, I was very impressed with how professional this young lady was. She didn't know I was a food blogger and she was super kind to me. I let her know after I placed my order, I told her, I said, I'm going to let my people know that you were very kind to me. And so they got chicken sandwiches up there. They got grilled chicken. They got uh, uh, they got uh, burgers and all of that. So here's what I decided I would get. I got the New York hot sausage with the onion rings. All right, and then I got their chicken sandwich. Look how huge this joker is. This joker is huge with cheddar cheese on that joker. And it's nice and huge and thick and hot. All right, so we got that. That look good, don't it? That sunlight hit that joker, right? And then they got the New York hot sausage with chili, mustard, and onions. And y'all know I normally don't do onion rings, but I did it for you all. Make sure y'all turn y'all notifications on. Show this video some love so people can know what's up. Now, I do have this one art against them. They serve Pepsi products. I don't know what's up with everybody and their mama doing Pepsi products. And when I got here, I was blocked by a Pepsi truck. All right. So like I said, this food truck is open till 3 a.m. every day, I believe. And um, yeah, so let's go for it. So they got tater tots and they got french fries. But I decided for you all, I would go for onion rings because we said we're going to try something different. All right, let's go for it. Heavenly Father, thank you for this food that I'm about to receive. I ask you to bless it in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, so y'all see these onion rings look yummy. Let's go for it. Now I know. Y'all heard that crunch. Now, I am going to say this. They're not bad. I don't know if y'all would want to go by me since I don't really eat a lot of onion rings. But it's okay. I have had some onion rings that had like a sweetness to their batter. But it's not bad. I just feel like perhaps... I should add me some ketchup to it. So if you're late to this video, I'm at 24-7 Eats food truck. So they're not bad. We just throw some ketchup on it. I feel like if I had some, I feel like if I had some, uh, Heinz ketchup. I love me some Heinz ketchup. Let's go for that. All right. So I don't know if y'all put barbecue sauce on y'all onion rings or if y'all like ketchup, but let's go for it. All right. Thank you for the stars too. Y'all support allows me to keep producing content. So everything that you send in, I want y'all to know it's appreciated. All right. All right. Mm. Mm. 
I need ketchup. You throw some ketchup on this onion ring. And it makes this joker yummo bako. This food truck is located at 2205 Portlock Road. Now they got 24 7. The number spelled out for the name of their food truck, but if you go to Facebook, it's spelled out 24 7. All right. So the onion rings are a win. Let me do it with some hot sauce. I've never had an onion ring with a hot sauce. But it's a win with the ketchup. All right. That one, all the onion came out. So let's try. Let's try this one. Mmm. Okay. Hot sauce on an onion ring. That's actually good. All right. That's different, but it's actually good. I still think I would rather have the ketchup, though. I want y'all to know that I love y'all, and I'm so glad to see y'all. Just wanted me to be more consistent. So this is not your traditional hot dog bread. This actually looks like where you would do a sub. It is a little bit toasted, and it's supposed to be a New York hot. I want y'all to see how hot it is by opening up the sunroof. So it looks a little messy. Some people can get sauerkraut on it, but I didn't do that. So here we go. All right, we're going to bite this, all right? Now, before I take this bite, please, everybody, throw some hearts and likes up on this video. Let's get to over 500 people liking the video. And just hit the share button, all right? And I'm, I haven't seen a lot of y'all in a while because they've been turning y'all notifications off. So if you would just tap the screen, Yummo Bucko will come up at the bottom and click Get All Live Notifications. And then add me to y'all favorites, too, by tapping the screen again and clicking those three dots. Let me tell y'all something. I got more videos coming. We're going to be going to Orlando, and I don't want you missing out. And I'm picking four buckle buddies that I'm going to give a voucher to Krispy Kreme Donuts. I got four of these I'm going to give away so y'all can get a dozen donuts. So if you don't get on the lives, you won't, you're going to be missing out. All right, let's go for it. But I am glad to see y'all. All right? This is big. Now, this is a sausage. And why is it? Okay, shut up. Shut up, Jamal. That's a New York hot sausage. That's a New York hot sausage. My only complaint with this is the fact that this bread is big enough to put a sub on it. If they just, if she just kept the, the bun simple, I'm telling y'all, this would be like a boop boop. It's grilled or, you know, hard. So I don't know how juicy it is, but, you know, it's a little, but it's got chili on it. And it is spicy. But let me tell you, it's flavorful. <sighs> That's a... Whew. Like, it's just too much bread. But with that mustard and them onions on that joker, that is your mobacco. It's almost like big enough you fit three of them in there. But flavor-wise, it's good. It's your mobaka. That's a huge sausage. I just feel... Shut up, Jamil. That's good. Like I said, get this and a smaller piece of bread. That's your mobaka. Mm -hmm. And look, I just need half of the bread. But look, what kind of food truck you know be out here to three in the morning? <clears throat> you know, and during the middle, after you're done with your late night creep, you can go get you some food from 24-7 Eats. <sighs> ah, 
Marco said, somebody tag Ben's Chili Bowl and tell him how it's supposed to be done. Hey, y'all know I've been there and I ain't like it like that. Look at this chicken sandwich. Woo! That thing big. That thing big. Doesn't that thing look pretty? Now, this is a chicken sandwich that looks pretty. It looked too pretty to eat. She is generous with her portions. And this sandwich still hot. I did all that talking and this sandwich still hot. So it looks like it got, okay, so it's cheddar cheese, excuse me, mayo, lettuce, and tomato. And I know a lot of y'all are funny about warm lettuce and warm tomatoes. So the longer, so he said, where are they located? They are located, somebody type this down, 2205 Portlock Road in Chesapeake. All right, I'm gonna just show y'all. So this is a laundromat. You'll see Daily Needs. That is a uh, Campostella Road, right? This is Portlock Road. You see the laundromat right there? All right, then they got the Daily Needs convenience store. Then you got the railroad tracks going to uh, going to Portlock. All right. So let's go to the sandwich because this look good, right? You can get provolone cheese, all of that. And I just appreciate y'all being on this video. They told me if I get more consistent, more of my buckle buddies would be up here. And I'm glad to see y'all. All right, let's go. It's juicy, it's thick. But to me, the chicken itself is more on the bland end. It's got mayo, it's got cheddar. I wonder if I had kicked this up differently if I had did pro, uh, I think if we had did some pepper jack, this would have been better. It's 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 thick, it's juicy, it's definitely not dry. But I don't know if it's too much chicken, you know, because sometimes the ratios it could be just too thick. So you just you you're just eating like more juicy meat. But it's definitely juicy. I wonder if I was to throw some hot sauce on it, if I'd be good. And here at this food truck, they said that looks like real chicken, not one of them imitation parties. Okay, I feel you. So I put some hot sauce on it and we're going to see. All right. Now, let me look at this video because I want to see, did my bucko buddies share this video or are they just sitting on it? Because I know I'm not the boss of you. Right. All right. So only 259 out of 633 of y'all like this video. Come on, bucko buddies. Show a brother some love. All right. Let's go. Okay, so adding more hot sauce on it would be good, but to me, it's just too thick. That is a huge piece of chicken. That's just one part of it. So, so I would just say my two adjustments would be not so much thickness with the chicken, maybe cut it down some. And then maybe not use such a big piece of bread 
for the New York hot. But flavor-wise, the New York hot is the win. And I don't know what you could do to spruce up the flavor of these um, onion rings. But they were good with ketchup. But uh, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to save my appetite. Because my old co-workers are taking me out to eat celebrating my birthday, which was May 26th. And we finally get to go out. So, I better save a little bit of appetite for that. But I appreciate y'all for watching. And like I said, the rep, the owner or the, the person that helped me was very, very friendly. She did not know I was a food vlogger. So, that lets me know that she's kind to everyone. But when she hit me over the head with the fact that they're open to 3 in the morning, I'm like, oh my gosh. That's what's up. <clears throat> I'm at 24-7 Eats. Make sure y'all hit them up on Facebook. You got to spell out 24-7. All right. They are located at 2205 Portlock Road. All right. And yes, the meal costs 22 22 39. I want to show you that receipt, but I don't want y'all getting my credit card information. All right. 2205. 2205 Portlock Road, Chesapeake, Virginia, 23324. Now, Joetta, Joetta Passima, do you like Krispy Kreme donuts? Because I really appreciate you uh, sharing information. Inbox me if you like. Uh, Krispy Kreme donuts, uh, Joetta, but you got to do it within the first five minutes. If you do it later than that, no. They have Pepsi products and they got fruit punch, but I went across the street right over there in their deli needs and got me a Coca-Cola. My name is Jamel Spaulding. Yummo Bucko is my expression for good food. I want to thank God and I want to thank you all for your support. I want to thank Sophia for 20 stars and Thelma for 100 stars. Listen, in order to keep doing these videos, your support is definitely um, appreciated. All right. I love y'all and I will talk to y'all in the next video. Like I said, they are very, very friendly and I wish them the best. Father, in the name of Jesus, I want to thank you for 24-7 Eats. I pray that they'll continue to do what you put in their in their hearts to do and that they will continue to prosper and, and that they will have the followers that they need. And I ask that you will protect them in Jesus name and may their food forever be made with love and be consistent and lots of love. I thank you for them, their name being in high demand. And I thank you that even though I may care for this or not care for that, it doesn't mean that a whole slew of others uh, won't pack this food truck out. So I just wish them nothing but the best. And I just pray that you would continue to guide them and that they will obey your voice in Jesus name, Lord. Amen. All right. I love y'all and I will talk to y'all in the next video. Let's eat and critique coming from 24-7 Eats in Chesapeake. Love y'all.